Alrighty. There is sound at the end. New version here. I'll wait until the end here. And... What are you looking at, butthead? Cool. Question for you is I still feel like the What are you looking at, butthead? There's some ambient movement here, but I still feel like I oh don't know, there's a question for you. Are you gonna take out that exhale or put that into your animation? Butthead. <laughs> is that something that's gonna be taken out of the audio or being put into the animation? Butthead. Other than that, I think I still see to me there's still that sudden hiccup in the forward translate right there and I think we can still be a bit snappier on those legs when they go on that I think on the tail instead of one axis turn like that could be a bit more elaborate not to make it overly complex but just giving it one more axis of of orientation there <clears throat> and I think See if you can move, make that eye a bit bigger, just so we can really see that it's looking over there and potentially push the incandescence of the eyeball so it really stands out. I think that could help. It's nice though, I like that. That look there with the tilt. And then that's fine. This might be a bit far with this. I could be wrong. I don't know, there's something in this where I personally would bring it just maybe a bit here. Or I split the difference. The other guy's fine how he looks. I think you are just borderline tangent there with the tip on that. So either curve them down or bring them down or switch out how the, the tip of those ears are there. Now, I'm going to profess ignorance in terms of ears of horses. This feels a bit soft to me. I could be totally wrong. It felt like they move. They're just a bit more solid, a bit faster than they move. This feels a bit spliny, but I could be wrong. I would have to look. Like the detail stuff already on your stirrups there, if that's what it's called. <laughs> and then you go pop, pop, pop. This could have a little bit more of a, let's see. It feels like everything kind of stops at the same time. I'll be careful. I know the camera stops before the horse. But maybe I'm reacting to, the body is kind of stopping at the same time as the legs are moving. Ooh, maybe that's, that's I don't, there's a slight feel of Everything just kind of two stopping at the same time. Final bit of offset there. <laughs> like that, like that. Oh. I think I will push the connection a bit more where when this goes up here, it feels a bit separated. Anything you can do maybe with a roll or something in the chest so that that massive neck is affecting the chest as well. This is totally fine as a cheat coming up. Maybe, I don't know if you have a control to move that ridge down or move that pupil a bit over so it's not so lost. I know these are over fast frames, but even here I would bring that lower lid a bit lower. So we're not cutting too far into the pupils. Let me go find that frame again. You like see how much we see of the eye, of the white, and then the iris. I think this gets to me almost a bit too far because you're almost 50% there. And then that breathing at the end, if that's something you're planning on putting in, let me know. It's cool though, nice progress. We'll, we'll like it, like what you have. Let's watch this again. What are you looking at, butthead? I like your anticipation on the shape before he talks. What are you looking at, butthead? What are you looking at, butthead? And as much as I want a couple of frames taken out of this, I feel like we can add one or two frames to that moment. Mainly because we were so close to camera. Or you might want to slow this down just a smidgen. Butthead. But that might just be me again. Yeah, and just overall be cool. It's just, I feel like this gets kind of lost. Anything we can do to show that pupil a bit more. 
but I'll leave it at that. All right, thanks. All right, there's an email. You can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.